All right, I'm gonna go over kind of what I've done uh, these last couple nights with the AT Tiny 84. Um, I've got my development board working now, and things seem to be up and running. The last thing I did was get a uh, shift register working. That's that guy in the middle there, um, or a bit shifter, whatever you call it. So, um, yeah, the whole, I don't know, it takes a certain amount of, or a certain sort of inputs, it takes three inputs, um, two clocks, and then data. And this is kind of what I wrote out for how it how it works. The data comes in, the shift register clock input clocks the 8-bit output, and then you lock it in with the um, locking clock there. Anyways, all I have is a simple counter that's counting up, and uh, it puts it out in 8-bit um, binary. So I hit the reset button here. And it starts at zero. Um, goes up every tenth, tenth of a second, I want to say. Um, so yeah, there's the shift register. Now, actually, I'm going to um, it's a little bit hard to do with one hand here. Um, we're going to go into interrupt. And I'm going to flash the interrupt code onto, onto the board. So there that goes. And uh, now my now the chip is sleeping. And it sleeps until it gets an interrupt from, from this guy right here. My interrupt is hooked up. Um, this is five volts going into an LED, which then goes into one side of a button. Oh, the other side of a button, it is uh, pulled down to ground. This is ground right here, but then here's the input. So when I hit this, hit this button, all of a sudden uh, the input here goes to five volts, so it goes to high. Um, anyways, what I did was the same thing as a counter, but I had to implement a debouncer too, so you'll see the code on my blog, but yeah, you can see me. Uh, click this, it has a software debouncer, it kind of just waits until it's a steady signal. Um, you can see it counting up. So this is solely using interrupts, it's not like checking it like um, in a, in a, you know, in, in a loop, it's not checking this input all the time, it's, it's getting uh, called by an interrupt service routine. So. So yeah, it's just counting up again in binary. So, um, so yeah, those are two two segments of code that I've been working on. And check out my blog for uh, code and how it all works.